book of Revelation, chapter 19. Again, the book of Revelation, chapter 19. When you have it, please stand. Do we all have it? Amen. 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 The book of Revelation, chapter 19, verse 1. And after these things, I heard a great voice of much people in heaven saying, Hallelujah, salvation and glory yeah. and honor and power unto the Lord our God. Verse 2, for true and righteousness are his judgments. Yeah. For he hath judged the great whore which did corrupt the earth with her fornication and hath avenged the blood of his servants at her hand. Verse 3, and again they said, Hallelujah, and her smoke rose up forever and ever. Verse 4, and the four and twenty elders and the four beasts fell down and worshipped God that sat on the throne saying, Amen, Hallelujah. Verse 5, and a voice came out of the throne saying, Yeah. Praise our God, Praise God, all ye his servants, and ye that fear him, both small and great. Last verse. And I heard, as it were, the voice of a great multitude, and as the voice of many waters, and as the voice of mighty thunderings, saying, Hallelujah, for the Lord God omnipotent reign. Mm. If I had to tag a sermon topic for today, this morning, it would simply be, don't fall asleep on Jesus' return. Amen. I think I'm going to say that again for the first time. Don't fall asleep on Jesus' return. Don't fall asleep on Jesus' return. And for the Holy Spirit, don't fall asleep on Jesus' return. Because he's soon to come back. He's coming back in the thief in the night. So, as I was studying this sermon that God had prepared me, he said, Son of Abraham, Pastor Michael, I want you to tell Right Division Ministry to get ready for Jesus' return. Because yeah. you don't know when he's going to come back. You don't know when he's going to take you away in the twinkling of an eye. Amen. Amen. So the Bible says here that Jesus is going to crack the sky at any moment. Yes. I want you to know this morning that you have to be ready mm. in season and out of season. Because Jesus is going to crack the blue sky. I found out that when, you, that when you're in heaven, you're living, you see the clouds, they're heaven. And I see here that churches have compromised and conformed to the ways of the world. And if they don't reopen the doors of the church at any moment in hell, that's where they're going. That's what I'm here to tell you this morning. Don't fall asleep on Jesus' return. I want you to know today that you are somebody. Yes. You have a journey. You have a destination yes. to accomplish. God is preparing you for his assignment. Yes. So we want you to be ready right now. So in the sermon, I noticed that verse 3 simply means mm -hmm. that God will throw your past punishments in the sea of forgetfulness. Yes. Well, Romans 14 and 11 through 12 will tell you right now.
verses 11 through 12, Romans, Romans 14. You don't have to turn it. For it is written, as I live, saith the Lord, every knee shall bow to me, and every tongue shall confess to God. Yes. Verse 12. So then, every one of us shall give an account of himself to God. Yes. Can I tell you this morning that you're going to stand before God. I'm not going to be there with you. It's going to be you and God. This is me as God. You're going to stand right here yes. Yes. and yes. give an account. And what he's going to do is that he's going to flip the book before he says, well done. What did you do in my name? What? What did you say in my name? What did you proclaim in my name? I also noticed that verses 1, 3, and 4, and 6 tells me that hallelujah simply means hallelujah. That's where the word hallelujah comes in. And anytime you say hallelujah, you're letting God know that he is worthy to be praised. You're letting God know that I have the spirit of gratitude. Yes. You have yes. to let God know that I am thankful for everything that I have. Yes. Yes. My God. Yeah. I'm here to let Right Division Ministry know that every knee is going to bow and every tongue that will confess. Yes. Yes. I, want, I want to tell you this morning that... Uh, I want to let you know today that when we get to heaven, after we give an account, yeah. we're not only going to see our brothers and sisters in Christ, yeah. but we're going to see our angel. We're going to see Pop. Yeah. We're not yeah. only going to see that. We're not only going to see our angel and Pop, yeah. but we're going to see our brothers and sisters yes. in Christ yes. that who has gone to be with the road, Lord Jesus. Yes. Yes. That's the song comes in. Won't it be grand? Can I tell you this morning that my God reigns. He is omnipotent. He has everything that we need. He is our stimulus package. Can I tell you today that God is good and all the time. God is good. Sometimes you got to stand firm on God's word. Every now and then when you say